Hello everyone, Son of Beast here. Welcome to the preseason of the NBA 2K24. As of this one, this is last year's 2K Sports one of 2K23. As we noticed from before, that I have officially done the one of the NHL preseason. There was four games that turned to be out in between the two matches. The first two and the, and the second two. It was a fun one to have a match, but this time, we're going to switch it up a little bit differently for the preseason. As you know, every season from in between of me and Chris Sonic Guy were almost the same thing as well. But you can't go wrong in between of which one it is. So it's a tough one to try to figure out which one it is. So, this will be the first day after the Black Friday sales. I hope you enjoyed your holidays of Thanksgiving and are ready to kick in for the season. And then, pretty soon, with the taking days off, we're going to get started with the regular season of 2K24. Yeah, are you pretty excited? Yeah, you know I am. And with that being said, it's time to figure out what the preseason is. First up with the team, we got New York Knicks and the Cleveland Cavaliers for a recap of season number four of Son of Beast. This is the first thing that I never get to do this one here for my life. Um, for a part of a game that, that I haven't really checked it out before. But as you may have already noticed, this might be a, one of the first games that we're about to be seeing in between the matches. The starting lines are being appeared as followed. Jalen Brunson, Josh Hart, R.J. Barrett, Julius Randle, Mitchell Robinson, and the Cleveland Cavs side, Darius Garland, Donovan Mitchell, Isaac Okoro, Evan Mobley, and Jared Allen. And they also have played it in the playoffs, too, so this is the toughest matchup, but now they meet again. Let's find out how they do. Standing by, I have the commentaries up on the board. Let's see how they do. Guys, take it away, and I'll see you all later for the halftime show. As, as standing by will be Kenny Jet Smith and Shaq the Shaquille O'Neal, and I'll be back with the post-game show after this. So with that, it's time to do it. Enjoy, guys, and let's get the games begin. 2K Sports, welcome to you to the following presentation of the NBA Playoff. Welcome, everybody, to another presentation of the NBA Live on 2K Sports. Alongside Hall of Famers Doris Burke and Grant Hill, I'm Brian Anderson. Allie LaForce on the sidelines. Allie, it's all yours. Thanks, Brian. Well, Jalen Brunson, a second-round pick out of Villanova, and his father carved out a nine-year journeyman career in the league as well. Jalen said, quote, how hard he worked just to get unguaranteed contracts showed me that I have to work ten times harder. I thank him for letting me see that at a young age. Guys? The uh, family business. Allie, thanks. And here's the starting group for the New York Knicks. And forward, it's Barrett and Randall. Josh Hart is out there with Jalen Brunson. And it's Robinson in at the five down low. And for the Cavaliers, the lengthy pair of Mobley and Allen are together inside. Darius Garland is out there with Donovan Mitchell. And it's Okoro in at the three, the small forward. Yeah, ever since the Nets relocated to Brooklyn in 2012, the rivalry between the Nets and Knicks has intensified. Now both teams trying to prove that New York belongs to them. Outside Brunson. Outside Barrett. Here's Robinson. It's hard on the wing. Pass to Randall. Another shot. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Outside Barry. Back to Brunson. Hart from long range. Nailed Josh Hart for arc. three. It'll be hard for the Nets to take New York City away from the Knicks. They've been there so long. It's so true, VA. But the Nets have attracted more star players lately. Top free agents choosing to go to the Nets instead of the Knicks. We'll see if this trend continues. Sure. Julius Randle. 
Sister Brown. Okay, go. So you have to respect him off the dribble drive. And that was the mobile one drive. Low resistance to the finish line. Yeah, taking the onus on himself to make something happen. Got it into the teeth of the defense and made them pay. Garland, the pass to Allen. And here's Mitchell. He's covered by Hart. Six to shoot. Here's a Coro. The Knicks with the rebound. Pass to Randall. Julius Randall. Well, if you're Julius Randall, sprint the floor and get an easy one. And so it's Cleveland with it. It's a three-point game. Here's a Coro. Back to Garland. Left side. Here's Allen. Sure. Allen. Hit home. Well known for being a turn mobile with the assists. Right there. Case in point. Pass to Robinson. And he drops in Mitchell the Robinson. Well, uh, you want Mitchell Robinson to finish with strength and authority. He does there. Early in his career, Mitchell Robinson feels like an old school big to me. This guy owns the painted area. He's completely focused on finding those close range opportunities to score. Now here's Allen. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. New York ball. And you've got to be in awe of incredible defensive efforts like this. That'll put some fear into the shooters, and he made sure to do it early, too. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Mitchell Robinson's focus on high percentage looks has given him record-setting efficiency goals. It has, B.A. In the abrupt 2020 season, he finished with a field goal percentage of 74%. That put him over Wilt Chamberlain's old record. I think that says it all. And there's the pass. Right. The whistle blows. Chance of the Cleveland foul, number here. four. One Evan one Mobley. One. His first personal foul. First team foul. And Adam Allen to check out the line the Knicks. Scoring Knicks. Right for the Knicks. Uh, the line, the one shot. shot facilitating so far. So moving the rock and finding the open man, just great selfless basketball. I think the other thing they've done a great job of is making their presence felt inside, converting tons of pain opportunities. Robinson's gotten his second bucket of the game. For Cleveland, they've gone three of five here in the opening quarter. Here's the Coro. Outside Garland. Back to a Coro. Pocket six. Gets a six. I said a Coro. For two. Timeout, New York. Now a timeout called by New York. Of course, we hear a lot about how much space Isaac Okoro can cover at the defensive end. And it's important, B.A. Here we have an agile, athletic defender who's got length to bother those elite shooters, a quickness to cut off penetration, he can jump passing lanes. Being this kind of defensive player is critical in the league. And one thing to say about the critics in the league, there's a tons of stuff here that, that we got that they have shown it off. A lot of percentage of his uh, workability, they've been turning things over and over again. But not to worry how they did, it's how Harvey had done it with a, a lot of accuracy motion. The possible, the angle of how they did, I mean, this is what everyone does. Nobody has ever seen how they were doing on the court and getting it done. That's whatever happens. Most of the time, 
the player is going to get it done and do the best as they can and get done. It's a lot of hard work. And the Cavaliers going with a whole new group out there for the Knicks. And here are the Knicks now, leading by five. Toppin outside. Back to quickly. Knocks it loose. Two minutes remaining in that first period. Two minutes. To the paint. Here's Toppin. Hits the jump. OB Toppin. Excellent concentration by OB Toppin. It doesn't matter where he is on the floor. This guy's physical and he's willing to absorb that contact. The bird outside. Osmond, guarded by Toppin. Osmond, let's see! Osmond! Is here, not just falling in love with the three ball. The Knicks have gone 7 of 9, a solid percentage so far. Pass to Hartenstein. He takes it too quickly. Now Rose. Three pointer. That's quickly with a miss. Well, he won't miss many from that spot. The defense gets lucky there. Levert. Outside, green. He tries the three. The shot by Rubio, no good. New York has gone one or two from three point land so far. Here's Toppin, and it's New York. Oh, he's top. The very definition of a stretch. I say it quickly. He's a knockdown shooter, so vital for the spacing to his basketball team. Green finds Rubio. There's 38 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. New York got on the wall. Already top. It's first personal top. First team top. And a line for the Cavaliers. City Osmond. And a line with two shots. First free throw is good. That one goes in. Two from the line that time. 36 seconds left in the opening quarter. Pass to Hartenstein. And here's quickly. And he wills it. Nice quickly. Right through the back of the iron. This guy is a pick your poison kind of player. Very hard defensively to cover all your bases with him. Quickly against the bird. Quickly, it's stolen by Rubio. Here's Wade. And so That's the end of the first quarter of the period. New York Knicks, 19. Let's take a quick break. And it's called the second quarter after this. And now, please welcome to the floor. And for those of you just tuning in, second quarter action is where we are. All right, guys, what's your take on the Knicks so far? They're off to a rock-solid start. They brought a well-thought-out plan into this one. What terrific work at the offensive end. They have built some early momentum here. And we know dead ball situations are where some fans change the channel. Doris, has the league done enough to discourage intentional fouls? Every form of media to me, BA, is trying to capture the imagination of their fans. So anything that enhances your product is something that in the long term is going to do well for you. Okoro at the three, with Mobley at the four. Darius Garland is out there with Mitchell. And it's Allen in at the center position, locking down the middle. So that's who's on the floor for the Cavs. R.J. Barrett. By Barrett. Is this from um, Josh Hart? Now, and this could be a crucial point in the game. Well, working hard, building out a small lead. 
but you can't afford any kind of letdown here. Evan Mobley! Big time, tough finish. Evan Mobley doesn't back down. Outside mark. Run two with it. Now guarded by Mobley. Here's Barrett. Oh, 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 Coming up later will be the halftime show as we'll be about to be seeing the Cavaliers and the Knicks. It will be happening to be on the start run for the Knicks run. They've been doing a lot of uh, hard maintaining its run. They beat the Cavaliers in a fourth seed team. And then they move on and they get the second round to face against the other team as well. As we were seeing it before, the Miami Heat. This was the first one that nobody has ever seen how they were played. And all they did was keep it right in the own line and then do it the best as they've got. They're doing it so much well and they are keeping it right on the side of the line to just do their best. And for right now, we have to find out if another career puts up for Cavs or for the Knicks. That'll be all coming up right after this first half. Guys? into the second. Pass to Okoro. Here's Mitchell. Back to Okoro. Fires the three. Three! Starlight! This is something they could really use from Okoro, guys. Put it in foul, number four. And then Mobley. His first, his first foul. That's first foul. 
14 top. The Knicks have gotten off to a perfect 4 for 4 start in the second. Brunson passes to Barrett. Back to Brunson. Pass to Randall. The kick out to Brunson. Over Garland. Bubbly grabs the board. Couldn't quite line that one up. Just kind of shake it off and move on to the next one. Here's Allen. Big foul, number 30, Julius Randle. His first personal foul, first, first team foul. And a line for the Cavs, Julius Randle. Turn out, and a line, shooting one. Martin Stein, he's checked in for New York. Try to get the names right away. A little too much fast talking. And with Mobley, he's already drawing comparisons to other personal pigment doors. Um, yeah, I don't want to get rid of myself, but this guy has a chance to become one of the elite defensive Defense! Defense! The top of this game, they are a scary team defensively. Now here's Brunson. Hard finds Randall. Julius Randle. This is Brock. Josh Hart. got four assists in the game. But Julius Randle, once he starts percolating, he's a dangerous offensive player. Mitchell against Hart. Back to Garland. Mobley outside. Pass to Mitchell. This one for three. The next with the rebound. Outside Barrett. Randle, the pass to Barrett. Back to Randall. Two minutes remaining in the first half of the period. Two minutes. Mark can hit. The Cavs trailing. Allen with it. Checked by Randall. Sure! Allen! Hit home! Julian throws Scarlet to six. Three friends! Back to Brunson. Pass to Hartenstein. Outside Barrett. Now Brunson. Guarded by Garland. Jared Jalen Brunson. Good play call and good execution. The offense running on all cylinders. Outside Mitchell. Lovely outside. Mitchell against Hart. They grab their own miss. For New York, they've got an impressive six of eight shots to fall in the second. Clock at six. To the inside. It's stolen by Garland. Here we go. And he loves it up top. And it's out of bounds. Out of bounds. <laughs> Cavaliers ball. Substitution for the play. For the Knicks. Derek Rice. And number five. And the new group. And Isaiah quickly. For the Cavaliers. And for the Cavaliers. Four players. Comes in for a quarrel. Ricky Rubio. Karis LeBron. City Osman and Desmond Wade. Rimes, he's checked in for New York. Quickly comes in for Brunson. There's 47 seconds left in the second. Osman, no good. Two for one opportunity here. Hey, if I'm in their shoes, I go for it. Randall. Ooh, now it's really a strike. Right after that base. Such it's a it's tough it's 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 Randall in that area. This guy is capable on the interior. <laughs> 34 seconds left in the first half. Levert outside. Pass to Osman. Allen with it. He's got 11. Next up! Randall outside. Outside Bear. Here's Grimes. But no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. And trust me, Isaiah he'll be the first guy to make them pay. And that's typical of this guy. That is it for the first half of the period. New York Knicks, 36. And Cavaliers, 26. Knicks out in front. They're up by 10. Well, now we have some time to check in with Allie LaForce. Allie. Thanks so 
much. I'm here with Coach Tom David Allen. Tom, what's it going to take down the stretch to win this ball game? I think just tough defense, take good shots, not turn the ball over, play smart. Back to the basics. Thanks, Coach. Thank you, Allie. Good stuff. We will be right back after this break for the beginning of the third quarter. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello, basketball fans. What a pleasure it is to bring you into the 2K studios again. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Penny and Jeff Smith. A stellar first half for Julius Randle. He had 14 points, 5 rebounds, and 1 steal. It is all happening for him so far tonight. An incredible first half performance. And taking a look at the Knicks, Shaq, what do you think? You guys know I appreciate the team takes a Attack in defensive area. Because I've seen looks good things to the That's how they do it this week. And uh, Ken, what did you see from Cleveland? Uh, the effort hasn't been there in terms of rebound the ball. They're getting out work to that part. So you've got to be more physical to turn this thing around. I don't know if they have the personnel to do that. And that'll do it for us. The third quarter about to begin with Kevin Harlan standing by. We'll catch you on the flip side, my brother. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Back to the game, Brian. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. Julius Randle has been sensational. Man, I love how effortlessly he scored. The game just comes so easy for him. Now let's see if he continues that trend the rest of the way. He certainly has the talent and the endurance to do just that. And here's Garland. So on the floor for New York. At the four and the five, it's Randall and Robinson. Josh Hart is out there with Jalen Brunson, and it's Barrett in at the three. Well, tremendous defensive effort on the interior. That's the kind of contest you want. Boy, when you think back to 2021 and the year Julius Randall had, guys, for the first time all the time, Jalen Brunson. This is the most award that year. Julius Randall. Then follows it up with a disappointing 2022 season. Here's Garland. Sharon Allen! Terry Scarlett with the assist. He wants to be great. It's hard on the wing. Back to Brunson. Barrett finds Brunson. Barrett up top. There's the triple. Fires. RJ Barrett for three. Barrett's got six. Talking about Randall Doors, you could see the emotions boil over at times during that 2022 campaign. VA, there were multiple fines and altercations, and that can happen when you don't meet expectations and frustrations now. And in particular, when you're dealing with your media and that passionate fan base, things can escalate. Now here's Barrett. This is the most they've led, 13 points. Julius Randall. Go. Boy, there was plenty of contact down low, but Randall assertive and able to find the finish. And we just had to see that mobile one drive one more time. Great stuff. You know, B.A., even with the game well in control, he's going right at the rim. I love it. Here's the Coro. Five points in the game. Back to Mitchell. Here's the three. The Knicks with the rebound. Robinson's got his fourth rebound in this one. Pass to Brunson. Outside Robinson. Inside. And Randall. Julius Randall. The assist from Robinson. Assist by 18 Mitchell points Robinson. for him. Well, defense is smart to get close to Randall, but he powers through it anyway. Mitchell against Hart. Shot to stop the run. And another miss by Cleveland. I think he's gone completely dry. Nothing is hitting. And this is where you hope that he can find something easy so he can see the ball go through the net. Now here's Barrett. Six points for him. Brunson passes to Robinson. Barrett with it. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. Callum's ball. Green's check in for New substitution for the Cavaliers. For Number 14. Danny Green. And now it's time to take another view of that huge swat. 
Oh my, oh my, and that was textbook defense, positioning himself well to send it back. Cleveland has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. Now for the Knicks, what's it going to take to bring them back to the glory days? Oh, that's a loaded question, B.A. But first of all, a superstar would certainly help. They haven't really had one for quite some time. If they can even develop or attract an elite all-star player, that would be a start to turning this New York franchise around and becoming possibly a contender. Throws it up high! And sure! Outside Brunson, pass to Toppin. Outside Hart, back to Toppin. Out to Rose. He's off on that one, and it's Cleveland the other way. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Here's Green. New York Pop. Number 23. Mitchell Robinson. It's set first. Her team back. And a line for Cleveland Cavs. Danny Green. Two shots. Substitution for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Osmond number 23. Dadman Wade. And, and number 16. City Osmond. Number 13. Ricky Rubio. And number 3. Karis LeVert. And both free throws good for Green. For New York, they've gotten four of their first five shots to go since the break. Pass to Grimes. Quickly, outside. To the middle. Oh, deflected! Arkenstein fainted in off the Arkenstein. Arkenstein's got his first two points. Well, everyone's two thinking about the first two points. Two minutes remain in the first Two minutes. Nicely done there. Outside, green. Levert. And Toppin pulls it down. Boy, nine times out of ten, that's going in. I'm sure he surprised himself with the miss. Back to quickly. Pass to Grimes. Over Green. Now we're a little long. The Cavaliers have gotten just 25% of their shots to fall since the half. Two for eight. And here's Rubio. Minute 15 left in the third. Five on the clock. Outside. Green. Hey, from beyond the arc. And it's Green. Ricky. His first Romeo. The deep ball. The bird with the ball. Now quickly defending. Pass to Osmond. That's it. City. I'm Ricky Rubio. Defense! Defense! To the inside. Over to the left wing. Let's it go for 11. This is off the left iron. Cleveland is going just 1 of 5 from 3 point range here in the third quarter. Here's Green. Had a chance there to cut it to single digits, but it's off target. The Knicks have gotten 5 of 8 shots to go in the third. Pass to Grimes. Knocks down the triple. Very rough. Three three. And the Knicks lead by 13. What a heads up play by Obi Top and feeds the open man. Easy opportunity. Now here's Levert. Here's Rubio. That's the end of the third quarter. It's the Cleveland Cavaliers, 37. And New York Knicks, 15. 
go away. We'll be back momentarily. Last quarter to go, and that'll be it for the Eastern Conference preseason of day one. Vince, pretty soon tonight, will be the Western Conference teams. We'll find out what it is. Substitution for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Brunson, he's checked in for New York. Number 31, Sherrod Alley. And good on the second, so he makes a move. Here's Mitchell. to Okoro. Brunson against Garland. Here's Okoro. Mobley down low. The shot that time, not on target. Randall with some nice D. Robinson finds Barrett. Randall left side. Out left to the wing. Back to Randall. Six on the shot clock. Here's Brunson, guarded by Garland. Here's Robinson. Basket Mitchell is Robinson. The assist from Brunson. Assistant Brunson. Yeah, Brunson. Yeah, Brunson. Assist in the game. Great passing. And no lack of aggression on that move. Good for the 2K drive. This Cavs squad is struggling. Outside Mitchell. Here's Okoro. And here's Mobley, checked by Randall. Mobley down low. Randall's there. Mobley, no good. New York has gone three or four from distance in this game. Brunson with it. He's picked up by Garland. Jalen Brunson. No on that one. And the Knicks lead by 19. And they're really rolling right now. That lead keeps getting bigger. Timeout, Cleveland. And one of the things that's helped that is they're getting it done on both ends. Terrific focus on offense, and they're locked in defensively. And the Cavaliers call time here. One of the stories here, Julius Randle, he's getting it done today. He's just really a one-man wrecking crew down low, and with this timeout, they've got to make some adjustments because he's been steady inside. Mitchell. Allen with it. 
Good work defensively by Robinson. It's all about the defense right there. Without that level of activity, he probably scores it. Right on this, right on. And trying to put the game away, he's been nailed all evening. And he hasn't forced much tonight. I love the efficiency he's giving to them. Now here's Mitchell. Here's Allen. That one's Sharon. Call it. Boring with confidence. I do call. What do you say? Wants to involve his teammates. Pretty pass there. Outside Robinson. It's Barrett on the wing. Hart passes to Randall. And it's good. Really, it's Two points. It. Randall's got it's ten good. points in just Josh the second Hart. half. What the puck has been flying feet wide for him. He's dropping everything in. Pass to Okoro. Allen against Robinson. Allen, pass to Garland. And he takes Curious. it. Curious. Garland. Very nice feed. Jared Allen with the assist. Oh, we see you making that look for a big man. That's a pretty pass. Robinson with it. It's Barrett on the wing. Back to Robinson. Here's Hart. And the Knicks get Josh, another bucket right there. Just in not the second half. Just so what it's in. Shots. And I think what's happening is they're getting their shots within the flow of their offense, and you can clearly see the difference. Pass to Okoro. Two minutes remaining in a four quarter period. Two minutes. Right side, Garland. Shot clock at five. Shot is up. The Knicks pull it in. Gotta move past that one. I mean, they want him to take that again. And they should, because it's when you start turning down that kind of look that your offense can start to bog down a bit. Now here's Barrett. Here's Randall. Kicks it out to Barrett. Jacks up a three. Drains the three. Barrett, Barrett. For three. Well, Barrett has got to become more consistent, but if he adds consistent three-point shooting, turn the lights out. Now let's face it, this one was never really in question. They came out with purpose and just overwhelmed the opposition. A great win for the Knicks. Number three, Julius Randle. The second first still back. This was the kind of performance of the Cavaliers. Evan Mobley. Very impressive win. Taking the two shots. Just to all the show tonight. Doing everything for his team. A monster night for Julius Randle. No doubt he came to play tonight. This guy has been aggressive and effective. And he makes the first. Three substitution for the Cleveland Cavaliers. He's a five-star recruit. He had his pick of college programs, and he finally settled on USC. And the Knicks making a change here. Sims, he's checked in for Randall. Fournier comes in for Barrett. Robin Lopez. Rose, he's checked in Ryan for Stevens. And it's McBride. And I got on. And, and both free throws good for Mobley. And it was brief, but Mobley's college career was filled with accolades, Doris. There's no doubt, B.A. How about this? In just one year with the Trojans, Mobley wins Pac-12 Player of the Year, Freshman of the Year, of course, and Defensive Player of the Year. That's quite a triple crown. Fournier finds Robinson over Mobley. Can't hit that one. The Cavaliers go the other way with it. There's 53 seconds left in the fourth quarter. It's hauled in by Robinson. And here's New York now. They've given up just eight points in the fourth. Back to Rose. Pass to McBride. And here's Fournier. 17-foot shot on the way. The rebound by Garland. 27 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. New York foul. Number zero, Derek Sims. His first personal foul. Second team foul. I think guys, you have to look at the line for the Cleveland Cavs. Darius Garland. That line for his main two shots. decision maker, even though he's young, he's not afraid to lead.
one. That's good from Garland. New substitution for the Cleveland Caps, number 32. Desmond, wait. Garland hits them both. Now Rose. Just let the clock run out. Hey, it's time to celebrate. Pass to Sims. Here's McBride. Now here's Rose. New York needs to get one up quick. The timer ticks. Evan for this tonight. Getting a win like this on the road is such a boost. That's the end of the game. Your final score for the night, New York, 67. At Cavaliers, 47. And so New York takes this one by a big margin. This one wasn't even close. The hometown crowd was waiting for a miracle that never came. Yeah, and this team was consistent throughout. They met every challenge and they earned this dub. And that about wraps it up. For Doris Burke, Allie LaForce, and Grant Hill, and our entire crew, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for tuning in. We'll see you later. All right, guys, thank you so much. So, so right now it is already the end as we take a look at the team comparison right in between this two. Here are the uh, stats of how they did with the games. This is a lot of point uh, percentage right in between the field goals, the free pointers, and free throws. But none of them were really going on there. Very that famous of what's going to happen. So there were a bunch of like fast break, points in paint, second chance, bench, assists, and a lot of defensive offense rebounds. That was turning out to be very quick than they have ever done here for the New York Knicks after beating the Cavaliers in the playoffs. It was a tough one to make that one maintain. And it's a lot of them to take some off. And plus the biggest lead was 22. So that being said, it was a lot. The time position for the Cavaliers was 12.37. Dunks were made for 6. Team fouls were only 3. Then turnovers had to be, be 2 already. Taking it over too much of the same time for at once. 1 blocks in between and 5 steals at the same time. So that's it for the Western Eastern Conference of the playoffs for the first day. Here are your 3 players of the game. First off, let's have a good look here in between the two. The third star, as you take a look from here, it all has to turn out that R.J. Barrett has 9 points, 2 assists in the game, and only had 13 performance run. Only had given a, a shot for 2 3-pointers, 3 out of 3 field goals. That's all you can trust for now. Second star, as we go the other way, we have is Jared Allen. He has 17 points, 1 rebound, and assist. You got a great block and five awesomeness dunk. I don't know how you can do that, but that was all it does turn out. Best center in a guard. And your first star player, your real New Balance player of the game, goes to Julius Randle. 24 points, 8 rebounds, 1 assist, and a steal. Only had 2 dunks per remained, and 26 performance run turned out to be one of the best. 11 out of 15 field goals were turning to be an awesomeness that he does. So that's it. That's for the first part of the day here in the NBA 2K24 preseason. Stay tuned for the later. And we will get our next one underway from Chris Sonic Guy. Yeah, I'm, I'm just definitely going to be making that one a little bit of a switch. So that will be the next one. And then when we come back, we will be ready for our next part of the uh, games that we will be seeing right across the board. It's a lot that hard and nobody has ever done move right in between from here and there. And that's a tough one that everyone does for the most game at a time. So that will be right in between the headline of the zone. It's between the Mavs and the Spurs. That's the next one from Chris Sonagai that will be for the Western Conference game since season number two. And the third and fourth game will be happening very soon in day number two. So with that, thank you all for watching, and peace out everybody for a while as the NBA preseason of 2K24 dial. Send a piece is out, and see you again for the next one. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.